video number 12 yay i'm gonna adjust this a little bit you're getting more of my chest here than you are uh belly <laughs> uh head yeah whatever all right got that figured out so now i just came back from farming a whole bunch of quartz and lead i'm just looking for inventory space to throw it in really quick and I'm probably going to have to make some more lockers, to be honest. Um, I haven't unloaded my prawn yet. We were in the process of putting a glass ceiling on there, just like what we have over in our uh, bedroom area. So let me get everything put away and processed, and then I'll bring you all back in. Okay, so I think I have the materials for our little project here. Um, let me bust out my little builder gun thingy. So I have one tube coming off from the main base into here and the other one coming off into here so let's put the glass dome on this thing and then I'm going to do windows all the way around it and then I'm going to do some reinforcements because I'm pretty sure this is going to oh five yeah so uh, I'm gonna have to find some lithium um, let's go ahead and put a hatch right here so I can get in there and then I can continue building outward over here and I can always go up and down here. So yeah, looking pretty good. So what I want to do now is put down reinforcements as well as, you know what, do I have bulkheads? Are bulkheads a thing? Um, interior pieces. No, no bulkheads. I wonder how I got that before. I went in every single place that I could, and I was looking around for them. I guess in Subnautica 2, they don't have bulkheads. It was like a little door that you put in between um, sections of the, the hallway or whatever in order to kind of strengthen the area. But, uh, hmm. Either I haven't discovered it yet, or it's not here. Okay, so how much lithium do I have? none on me and I'm going to change the rest into glass where's home here's home okay so let me find some lithium and some glass and I'll be right back okay so back to recording again what I have here is in the top right corner I realized that I have my little alien creation observation place and I was making glass to uh, put on my um, large room that I just made, but I thought, eh, you know, what? let's go ahead and do this first. And I got all the lithium in my. An aquarium just for looks, oh. or your own personal sushi factory. You decide. <laughs> That's alien containment. Why would that? Uh, I don't. Know. But uh, I got the lithium so I can put in reinforcements, and I got glass so I can make little windows. Um, I need a hatch. Uh oh, I think that was all the quartz that I had. Uh oh, but uh, I, I ran out of lithium and I ran out of quartz apparently. The last of my quartz was in here. One, I have one left. So I'm going to have to go on a, a farming trip and bring back lithium and quartz. But if I can get this going right now, and it looks like it can, I can start. <laughs> I've got to increase the strength of my base. The first little time I bump into it with one of my little vehicles, it's going to just flood and it's, it's going to be a mess. But let's go ahead and start hatching some of these dudes. Um, we can put some here, trade that. Oop, wrong way. So let's start putting these eggs here. So these should eventually hatch, and then I can scan them, or I can learn more about the uh, the little critters that come out of it. And do I have the lithium? Okay, I need more titanium on me. Keep running by checking the uh, the bioreactor. I've had it refilled a couple times in my uh, back and forthness that I've been doing. Okay. So. Let's go see what parts of 
a base we can reinforce and what parts we can put glass on to make it pretty. Okay, so that's an alien containment. And I wouldn't mind putting a window like here or here. But uh, a window, you know, right in front of the rock, that that's kind of it's kind of black. So I'll put some titanium here. Or some sort of reinforcement. I, I don't know what it's called. Reinforcement, it's called reinforcement. Okay. And then, um, I think I'm going to put reinforcements all the way around. Oops, I don't have enough titanium. All the way around. So then you can only see out one side. I don't really want to make a glass window just so you can see something kind of dull and boring. I might put a glass window here. So you can see in. Uh, maybe, maybe a window here. If I put a window here, all that's going to do is just have you look at the station. That's, that's kind of boring. So let's put some... Okay, what am I missing here? Oh, okay. For some reason, I can't build there. I don't have... I have a speaker there. That's what's going on. Okay. So let's put some glass over on this side. Okay. I have one more glass. How much more lithium do I have? Ah, too many buttons. Okay, I got five more lithium, which means I can put down five more things. I'm going to put them on this side because there's not really anything important to see here. So probably reinforcements on this side and then glass on the other side. Okay, there's nothing to see here, so I'll put uh, some reinforcement here. Okay, this is a good place for another one. Oops. Ran all the titanium again. All right, all right. So how much more lithium do I have after this? None. <laughs> okay, so I might as well just um, get rid of that last one. Ah, uh, itchy nose. Because there's, I, I don't have enough supplies for that. I do have enough for making the nuclear reactor. Um, it's it's getting like kind of laggy, so again I want to apologize. I don't have uh, the the proper video card for this, so if you're getting some hesitation or whatnot, it's it's on my end. It's not the video. Um, let me get rid of my two power cells here really quick. And my first subnautica, I I made a base, but it wasn't nearly as big as this one, so. I, it's kind of neat. I, I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> okay, so I can make the nuclear power plant. I need that, and I need three lead. And one advanced wiring kit. That is here. I'm trying to remember where I put the lead. I gotta get the lead out. Okay, so there's all three of those. Okay, there's that. I forget where I put all my rooms. Okay, so I'm going to put the nuclear reactor in here. I just remember that I was going to put the alien containment in here, but I put it back there instead. So, eh, you know, whatever. So I'll build this. And then I'm going to build the water purification station. Um, I need some heavy supplies for that. Do I have any titanium left? I do not. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to build that nuclear waste disposal. Because I've got some stuff that I've got to dispose of. Oh, where's it at? Right here. Two lead, one titanium. I could always put it in the trash can, but, you know, it's not... Eh. As a general rule of thumb, you don't want to throw away nuclear waste. <laughs> I, I don't know if I need to say that, but... I'm just kind of playing by the game rules. So, one titanium, two lead. Ah, too many, too many buttons. I keep saying that. You're full on power there. Okay. So, there's one lead. 
let me grab titanium from here. No titanium there. I had a place where I had a whole bunch of lead. And I forgot where I put it. Okay, those nuclear rods back there I'm going to have to grab at some point in time. So let me go ahead and fill them up now. Um, I might need some more titanium. I'm going to put some of these back for now. So I can make some shelves out there to basically move this shelf and everything on it out there. And then that'll free up one of my shelves to put stuff on. Running through a holographic image. That is pretty cool. So let's turn this puppy on. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's build the nuclear waste disposal. Uh, let's put it kind of in the corner. Okay, and then let's build... Oh, I need quartz. I don't think I have any quartz. Nuts, I don't think I have any quartz. Okay. So that being the case, I'm going to have to go quartz hunting and... There was something else I had to get. So I'll just stick with quartz for now. See, it's still. Yep. It's good having the nuclear reactor. I don't have to keep throwing stuff in. And, yeah, worrying that it'll run out. Alright. So the lead I don't need anymore. Let's put these things back. I'm going to grab the nuclear waste. And then um, go find some quartz. And I'll put the lead in here as well. So before I go farm, I want to put the waste where it needs to go. Let's see what it does. Nuclear waste disposal. Oh, okay. It just deletes it. Oh, that was a letdown. <laughs> Okay, got to go do some farming. Okay, so just a quick little update. I have the back of the prawn just about filled with quartz. And I'm in the process of trying to snag some more. Uh, and in addition to that, I have yet to kill any enemies. <laughs> no sharks, no... Uh, uh, none of those dog-walking shark things. So... I don't know what happened. Oh, there's one. Yay. Yay. Just in time. Bring it on, boy. That was over just like that. Wish I could get, like, meat off of them or something like that. But no, they just slowly dissolve and then they disappear and then they respawn. Yeah, well. Okay, so all that just happened. Crayfish, Arctic Ray, lily pad, and the other thing. I'm going to have to go back there. I, I thought I planted five eggs. So, um, maybe only a few of them hatched? Because if the prawn's completely full now, I've got four more. Oh, I, I think I need more quartz, so I'm going to uh, keep collecting. And then uh, I'll return. We'll do some investigating with the eggs. Okay, back again. So I got the majority of the cords filled up in my inventory, and then I have the prawn filled up with like seven eighths full of uh, cords. So I'm going to uh, go ahead and put that away where I can find room. <clears throat> then I'm going to make some more glass. Uh, oh, let's get rid of um, this thing right here somewhere. Doo, 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 doo. This one. All right, so that one's built. Now all we need to... Oh, shoot, I need to did uh, lithium. Okay. So I may go look for some lithium in a little bit. I am completely out of that. Uh, <clears throat> oh, we also made the nuclear reactor, so we can get rid of that. And we made the nuclear recycle thing. And get rid of that. 
So, <clears throat> oh, sorry, the list is getting shorter. Oh, there we go. There's all the other eggs. Okay, so um, I'm going to do the little glass. I'll be back, then we'll take a look at the little critters. Okay, so let's, <clears throat> oops, no, no, save, no, no, there. I'll get it one of these times. I just grabbed, um, yeah, I, I just finished the glass. And although it's hard to see, ah, I'm going to put in the glass panels. Yep, here we go. <clears throat> okay, it's at 40. I shouldn't need any more reinforcements, but I don't like to be short on materials. Mm, this one's kind of sticking outward, so that would be neat. I was kind of looking at the water. Um, I can't put any there. So I think we're done with the glass, unless we can put some here. Doesn't look like it though. Okay. Um, I don't want to put any here because it's kind of eh. Don't want to put any there. Should probably make an entrance to here, unless we want to keep building that way. Um, maybe I'll put. Um, one of those there, and then I seek will. Fluid intake. Yeah, I gotta seek a lot, of, a lot of stuff. I don't want to go too far out though, because I want to be able to access my vehicles and then, you know, I'd swim back and forth and whatnot. I don't know. I'll have to think about that one a little bit more. Um, but for now, uh, what else do we have to do? Uh, the water filtration. Um, let me get my batteries charged up and my power cells charged up, and I can do that off camera. So I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so I got my batteries recharging. The one's just about done. I got my power cells uh, fully recharged in my prawn. This has been going through little things like crazy. When I checked it again, it was down to one. So I was like, Ugh. but once again, I mean, my power's at over 3,000, and my lights were still blinking. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to just ignore that. But what we can do is I got my little scanner dude and we can go see what critters we have in here waiting for us. Okay. I'm just waiting for that little scanner thing to come up. Oh, there we go. That's kind of cool. We also keep various creatures as pets. Really? How does a species that uses the genes and bodies of other creatures view pets? They are curiosities that bring some sense of presence and energy. They oh, also the spider. To be evaluated for potential genetic enhancements. That's not a pet, Helen. That's a data point. Like you said, it's literally a test subject. You do not think they can be done. There's a distinction. Pets are something that you care for simply for the pleasure of doing so. Would humans consider me to be your pet? No, I said Ooh. pleasure, Alan. This is more like a job. Where I come from, you might be a pet. <sighs> I find that thoroughly disturbing. Nope. I can't put any of these in the aquarium. Okay, so that raises concern. If I put the shark out there, he's going to bite me. This guy attacks me. This guy explodes. I don't know who, what that is. That guy doesn't hurt me, so I can release him. But I guess I'll release him and see what happens. I also have my scanner looking for lithium. I have to go out and find a whole bunch of those. And I need to continue my list on the right. So let's see what happens. All right, let's get rid of him. You can play with him. Oh! He doesn't like rocks. Aww, that's so cool. 
Okay, let's tell him to stop following me. You wait here. And then if I do command to follow, okay. Could I do that with the other one? Because I raise them in captivity? That is a nay. Okay, these three guys are definitely predators, so I don't want to mess around with them. I'll just throw them in my trash. <laughs> oh, he's so cute! You can play with him! Oh, that's so Welcome cool! Aboard, oh, nuts. <laughs> oh, I can do that! Maybe I, I didn't have enough spaces or something. Have it uh, digest that. All right, let's get rid of the shark. The lily peddler. We'll do that in a little bit. While it's dissolving him, let's put uh, our batteries back in. Okay, let's dissolve him. And let's see if there's anything else that needs to be brought. Oh, quite a bit, quite a bit, quite a bit. Oh, I needed uh, titanium and I needed quartz in order to build um, my little cabinet over there. So I got those materials. Now I'm going to grab the rest of the reactor rods. This should be well more than enough power than I ever, ever, ever will ever need. Ever. <laughs> Of course, it depends on how fast it goes through, but, uh, um, okay, all those are good. So let's put, whoops, ability thing. Selenius, interior, freestanding storage. Let's put that there. Okay. I'm going to put the one in here, then I'll put the rest in here. There. That frees up a lot of room um, in my other base. So I wasn't, I, I didn't put glass all over the place because I would be just looking at the base and whatnot. But yeah, it looks pretty good. I like it. I like it. <laughs> okay, now let's grab some lithium. Um, but before we do that, let's see if we can do this water thing. I need copper wire, which is here. And I need the those and I need those I'm just gonna make a whole bunch okay so chemicals make these so that's enough for one water filtration I wouldn't mind having two because usually one is enough to sustain me if I'm just in base but generally I need two so that I can take some uh, you know off off from my base What do I need three more titanium? So I need one more titanium now Get some extra just in case <laughs> It's digesting the explosive fish. That's funny Okay, so let's put this up against one of them If we can oh, I just realized that we might not be able to because, yeah, that little thingy's there. Oh, had not even considered that. Okay, can we... Okay, we can destroy it from inside. So that means we should be able to build it now. Yep. So this in itself uses quite a lot of power. All right, so let's get rid of this. Put this back. So, once these two start, it should give me uh, more than enough um, salt and water. Do I have enough materials for one more? No, I need one more cup of wire. Okay, yep, that's up there. But what I will do is build like a temporary holding station, aka a locker, for the salt and for the... Oh! that for some reason that I hadn't finished uh, doing that. Uh, a normal locker should be fine. It's more cosmetic at this time than anything else. I should probably put a speaker in here. I may consider making another water thing. Aw, that's so cool. Maybe not though, because uh, um, 
Yeah, right now my power is kind of fluctuating. But it is dark time. And these things aren't going to run forever. And my scanner room is running right now. But my nuclear reactor is at full power. So, I don't know. I'll have to, uh, I'll have to keep an eye on it. Mm, let me throw some more stuff in here. Lights are blinking again. Let me see if there's any place to build some... Um, some more solar cells. Without messing up the landscape too much. Okay, let's just grab my little boat here. Okay, so I can put one here. This is my alien growing thing. Exterior pieces. There. So this will provide an extra 75. I got one on that. I can put one here, I suppose. I don't know how effective it would be, though. Oh, I can put one in the middle here. Okay, so that'll be an extra 150 when the sun's out. And get my little entrance here. Let's check on the, uh, the power status. So it's gaining a little bit. So that's alright. That's alright. So at night, it'll probably drip, uh, um, probably drop down a little bit. But during the daytime, it'll probably come back up a little bit. So that's okay. Alright, so let's get rid of the water filtration. Where's that at? There. Okay, the next one is the salt tablets or uh, the water purification. Um, I think I'm, now that I have the water um, creation thing, I don't think I need that anymore. So we'll just save the salt for the other uses. Uh, the reinforced diving suit, I, I wouldn't mind making that. So how many of those? I need two diamonds. There we go. So, heavy synthetic fiber dive suit, fighting physical protection and enhanced survival in extreme temperatures. So I got the gloves and the chest piece. Um, I have the booster tank. I don't use the booster function. I honestly don't know how to use the booster function. Um, everything else is pretty much maxed out. Lights are blinking, that's cool. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I need to stop. I need to stop complaining. Okay, so all that stuff is in. What's the one? Oh, indigenous life forms. Uh, it was fauna herbivores. Oh, it did. Oh, that's so cool. I wasn't quite sure what it was at first. I, I almost destroyed it. <laughs> okay, there's the thing about my pets, aquarium. It's it's not an aquarium, though. It's Okay, so I took down the satellite. Got that. So we need to go see the little lady about information about Sarah. Our little friend. Oh, let's get rid of that blueprint. What else do we have to make? Oh, the Pathfinder. Um, let's make that headlamp, too. What's it going to take? Uh, so I need gold and silver and an ion energy cube. And I'm sure there's another ingredient. I don't remember what the uh, recipe is. Do, 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 do. Lithium. I don't have any lithium. Okay. Lithium farming, it is. Um, let me make the pathfinding tool. I believe I can just run out here really quick. Grab um, this. And then titanium and a battery, which involves these. And copper.
copper. So I need one copper and one titanium. Should be here. Copper, titanium. Ah, this light's blinking. Okay, that. That's my battery, so it should be under tools. Okay. Then I do want to find a tool emits a sequence of waypoints to mark your route and aid navigation in both terrestrial and aquatic environments. Then I'm going to make some flares. Okay, one flare per. Oh no, that was more than one. Five? I counted five. There's no way. Holy cow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Huh. I made more than what I wanted to. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so uh, I want to go farm some lithium. I'll be back. Okay, so that just came up. I got a uh, new PDA. Uh, where to go? Right here. Just going back and backtracking some of this stuff. Control room rapid depressurization. Oh, okay. So that can that talks about the uh, control room. Okay, cool. So nothing real major there. The last communication was about the Pathfinder. I am still in the process of farming uranium. Or lithium. Okay. Give you a quick little update as to what I've got so far. So I found another creature. Again, I'm going to go back and hatch that. I have some lithium here. And the journey continues. Okie dokie, artichoke. So I finally... Whoops, clicked on the wrong thing. Got my little ion battery. So I'm going to need glass and titanium. There's glass. There's titanium. I still have uh, my prawn to unload. But I just wanted to see what this is. Comes with an advanced weather resistant strap that can withstand volcanic heat or an ice age blizzard. A perpetual, hands free light source in even the darkest environments. But is it going to work with my rebreather on? I highly, highly, highly doubt it. I think I need more inventory space. Okay, let me free up some room here really quick. Um, I also got a bunch of quartz and salt while I was out, as you can see. I'm sure at some point in time I'm going to need it. I'm going to fill up my initial lockers first. Dog's looking like she wants to go outside. The cat wanted out last night, so I let uh, him out. His name's Charlie. <laughs> he, he likes to chase the bugs. He does. I, I live out in the woods, so there's a bunch of chipmunks and you know, woodland creatures and you know whatever you can imagine. And uh, yeah, um, he leaves those alone. As as does Star. I mean, the the silliest thing is I'll take her for a walk. And she will try to dig up the little um, houses or whatever there. She'll stick her nose in it, kind of breathe, and then she'll, you know, do the little uh, scratching, and then she'll bite at the dirt and trying to pull it away. And if she finds a mouse, she's done this several times, she leaves them alone. She'll be like, ah, found it. And then she'll back up slowly. And then the mouse just, you know, casually walks away as if, you know, it's, it's no big deal. It's like, uh, hide, go, seek. I found you. Now it's your time to, to come find me. <laughs> it's, it's, it's it's so silly. There's this one time she dug up a mouse, and it was just the fattest mouse I've ever seen. And, uh, okay, I shut that off. And, yeah, it's just waddling away, and Star's like, what? where the heck did you come from? It's, just, it's like, uh, you would last probably two seconds out in nature by yourself. Okay, now I have a supply of salt coming. Uh, I still have plenty of nuclear rods. Oh, you know what? I wanted to put this on. So, yep, that's what I figured. So, it's handy if I'm not going underwater. And I wish I had that when I was on the ice and the island um, where that little wormy thing was attacking me. So, that would have been nice, but... I, I just can't use it. I just can't. I, I gotta have my rebreather on. I think I made a mistake. 
No, it's working. Converts organic matter into energy. So it's doing that right now. Maybe it's not doing that right now. Okay, so let me go ahead and reset this. I'll get the materials back, but not the fuel. Okay, so let's rebuild this. Maybe it wasn't designed to have fish. <laughs> Where's it at? Uh, right here. Okay, let's grab some of these nuts. Okay, so that should be four of them. One, two, three, four. That should start cycling up. I'll get some of these to uh, fill up my water needs. Put the salt away. I think all these lockers are full. That one, I'm just saving for equipment and um, uh, clothing and apparel like that. I think all of these are all filled up. I could get rid of some of those frost vases. Put some salt in here. Oh, that's a lot of water. Good. Good, 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 good. So I can start drinking pure water now instead of uh, going back and forth to um, uh, the, the plants. So I have a steady supply of water now. And now I have a steady supply of nuts and peppers. I'm assuming it's a vegetable. Um... Is that 99%? Going to top off some of my stuff. And then afterwards, I'm going to um, go to the one lady who wanted to see me. And in the meantime, I'm going to let Star outside. <laughs> just a second. Okay, so just as a point of reference, this is actually working now. So, um, organic matter. Apparently fish are not organic matter. So, yeah, live and learn. Got my batteries charged up. I want to go in here really quick because something I thought hatched. Oh, yeah, yeah, that guy. And since he is vicious, I am going to remove him. And put him in the trash. <laughs> oh, that's silly. Oh, you know what I just realized? Um, let me trash this guy really quick. Since I have a lot of water and a lot of food... Um, oh, I have an egg in my inventory. I didn't realize it. I took a little break. Um, I let the dog out and did some stuff and came back and forgot what I was doing. How do I get lost in my own base? <laughs> uh, it's getting late at night. And yeah, I I felt horrible today. Alright, let's go ahead and hatch him. Yeah, he got up at like 8. And it wasn't until about 4 in the afternoon until I started actually feeling somewhat normal again. Just, uh... Not looking for sympathy or any of that, just, you know... It's, it's the hand that I was dealt. Some people are dealt good in cards, some people aren't. <laughs> but what I was getting at was uh, I usually brought these around with me, and I may bring some as well. But these go bad after time. These do not go bad at all. So, that will be helpful. Uh, that's still full of supplies. Uh, oh, I'm going to drop off the uh, headlamp. I don't foresee the need for that. Um, I can always use my sea glide or my flashlight. Um, although that... It says it's battery powered, so I'm assuming the batteries run out. But then if you look at all this other stuff, it shows the charge, and this does not show a charge. I'm going to bring this guy along as well. You know what? I should probably bring some flares along as well. Yeah, I mean... You never know. There's my little dude. Okay, let's play with him. Uh oh, uh oh, ah, I got your nose. <laughs> I love that game. Hey, I, I can say things like that. I, 
All right, so entering the prawn, and I'm looking for the PK-8. Nope, not that. Um, where was it at? So it was in that general direction, which is east of there. So I'm going to go see what I can find. Be back in a little bit. Okay, so good news, bad news situation. I'm at the place where I believe I need to be, but it's way up there, and I'm in my prawn suit, and I can't get way up there. <laughs> so heading back home, going to swap out for uh, my little truck, and then I'll get in my truck and then come on back. Ah, I found another egg creature. So I am way deep down here, and I just killed a shark. <laughs> and uh, I'm just gathering up a little stuff. I, I don't think I'm going to need it, but, you know, yeah. And I think I found something new. So just trying to find where this alien thingy is. It says it's over there, but yeah, still having difficulty trying to find over there. Um, I'm at just about close to my max crush depth, so I will keep looking. Okay, found it. I, uh, I only spent about 30 seconds walking around, and I'm pretty far down. I don't anticipate this being anything really big. According to this, it's only architecture body cache so I'm assuming it's just like ion cubes or something like that ooh magnetite yes please I should probably search around for some more of those that's one of the ingredients that I'm kind of short on so I'm assuming I can't oh okay power down I still can't walk in there Hello? okay let's try this again yeah Nothing. Looks like I'm heading in on foot from here on out. Flashlight! This looks familiar. Hmm. Nope. Nope. I have not been here before. Okay, so let me try a little slash slash. See what, uh, see if I can get anything from this. nothing. Can't get the little purple flowers. Is that a scanty thing? It is not. Ooh, plants and things and stuff. It's not even acknowledging what it is. That was a plant back in um, the Subnautica 1, but it's just not showing up. So these are just purely cosmetic? Well, that's kind of a bummer. Looking for my little scanty thing. Icon. It's kind of a nice little tranquil place. Problem is, I can't pick up any of these things. So hopefully it's not key to uh, solving the game. So yeah, I, I think I've been here before. Because I would have got some sort of message... And I would have been able to scan that. Oh, all right, here we go. I thought I was supposed to scan the thing up there. The oh, there it goes, there it goes. Able to handle heavy forces. I got thrown from my new phone. Are you okay, Alan? It is not often that I gaze upon the form of a foreign architect. Is this place another sort of sanctuary? Sanctuary. Beautiful, even. As the bacterium spread, the continuation of life became uncertain. This is a place to reflect. I think I understand. It's a place to reflect. Okay, so that one's done. So let's go ahead and mark him off. Um, what is this location? No, that's not it. I've actually been there, so let me go ahead and mark that off. Well, no, no. I need to go back there with my little boat. Architect Battery Cash, that's where I'm at right now. I've done all these? I didn't, I don't think I did. Hmm, 
Okay. Well, I guess those are done. Um, that I've technically already have done, but the problem is um, I'm supposed to meet up with that one lady over there. Mm, excuse me. And she's supposed to tell me about Sarah. So I'm going to leave that there until I'm able to return and get my boat, uh, sea truck, whatever it's called. And then I shall return back. Okay, so I will see everybody in a little bit. And unpause. So this just came up. Oop, wrong button. Uh, tab T. You have found two of the three components required for the construction of my corporeal form. This is as close as I have come to autonomy in a long time. You have such a way with words. Is that sarcasm? It was. You're learning. Aww. I will not have time to complete my study. <laughs> I was wondering, if you can transfer bodies, why was it important to find a cure when you were infected? Couldn't you just make a new body? As you can see in the components you have scanned thus far, the forms we require combine biological and mechanical parts. The tissues you have scanned were developed from the DNA of 27 separate alien species. 27? That seems greedy. And wouldn't that mean that anything that infects a body you've manufactured can potentially learn how to infect all those other species? Yes. That is why a cure was imperative. That's why what was an imperative? Ah, oh, I missed it. Oh, cure. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, what did I learn in my databank? Oh, yep, that thing that I scanned. Okay, cool. So, blueprints, I'm guessing it's down here. Yep. So, I just need the organs. <laughs> oh, that's... That's gross. <laughs> okay. Food and water are full. Oh, yeah. Save, jump on out here, and jump in my prom. Actually, not jump in my prom, open my storage. Oh, just enough, just enough, nice. So I got some more uranium, just in case I go through all my uranium, which I don't ever anticipate going through. But, you know, who knows? Okay, that one's still somewhat empty. Time to head to my nuclear room. Running, running, running. Everything's still good. Oh, you know what? I should probably have made those into rods before I brought them here. Um, let me grab my stuff. Plenty of salt. Okay, looks like I'm bringing the salt with me. Okay, so I need some glass, I need some lead, I need some titanium, I think. Uh, but first, let's throw some stuff in the fridge. Okay, glass, lead, titanium. All I have to do is make two of them. So, there we go. Again, I highly doubt I'm going to... Uh, using these but you know eh, whatever okay let's put these things back I'm going to have uh, different applications that I can use for my salt um, I think I need that to make the hydrochloric acid yep yeah, that's still full and ready to go now if I could just have a meat source that didn't have to do with uh, fish that I could farm, like well, eggs or something like that, I would be doing pretty well. Okay, so this guy's empty. I'm going to park him. Figure that's the, uh, that's the best, play for, best place for him. Tripping over my words here. Okay, so I got flares. Uh, I'm gonna get one more thing of water. I tend to go through water pretty fast. Open up my fridge. Water, water. 
gonna jump into my seed truck. Now, well, first I should make sure the batteries are full. Okay, that one's a hundy, that one's a hundy. Okay, now I'm gonna make sure my uh, compartments are empty. Empty, 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 okay. I don't really need my sleeper, but you know, it's there. So, um, I, it took some damage. Okay, let me bust up my repair tool. Look like the second one, this one, needed some repair. Okay, I'm going to head back out to that one, um, what was it, PK-8, which is right there. So it's, she said it was 100 meters east of the island, so somewhere in that area. So technically, I have unlimited food and water, so long as I catch bladderfish. I should probably put these things somewhere else. They probably just swim right back into there into the thing. <clears throat> so I have a fabricator on me, and I have storage on me, and a bed. So technically, as long as I catch bladder fish, I should have enough food and water. And so long as I have food and get out, food and water, it should restore my health. Now what I'm going to do is get far away Release the fish. Right click dropping. It's a fury of fish. Right, jump back in. And yep, that's the one. So off I go go. Um so the big changes in this one was I increased the diving depth from four hundred to six fifty. And there is uh, number four, um, down there on the little menu, there's four little circles. The fourth one to the right is supposed to be an engine upgrade, which means I should be traveling faster, but I'm averaging a little bit short of uh, nine uh, meters per second, I guess. But uh, I, I am hauling quite a few things behind me in my recreational vehicle. <laughs> All right. See you at the location. Okay, I found a place, but then it's really cold here, so I'm not sure this is. I'm not sure this is the place. First of all, it's about where she said to meet her. She said it was an, on a iceberg. Well, well, what have we here? Dun dun dun. dun. Ancient artifact. Architect artifact. Architect artifact. Whew. That's a mouthful. New technology acquired. Sea truck teleportation module. I can teleport? And a tether tool. So I can tether things. You're not supposed to be on land. Silly thing. So maybe. This isn't it. Okay, I'm gonna jump back in the water really quick before I freeze to death. You're fine, okay. So let me warm up. I'm going to uh, look around a couple more times and then if I don't find it, I'm going to Hey, skinny dude. Um, look at the coordinates online just to make sure I'm in the right area. It seems like I am, but who knows? I should probably have uh, brought my cold weather equipment. No, I got plenty of those. I was looking for those little pepper things that you can eat and it warms up your body. Ooh, a thingy. Whoops. <laughs> That's, that was an ocean. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, it looks like a climby uppy thing. Hey, 
Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Dangerous weather right now? What are you talking about? Okay, I think I'm at the top again. Ah, oh, dang it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm getting back. I see things to eat. So I'm going to stock up on these until I can get my health back up. This gives you food and water. But not heat and not health. Okay, I'm going to jump into my little truck and then, uh... <laughs> what are you doing there, you silly fish? Yeah, you get oxygen from the middle of it. That's pretty cool. Okay, was any of this stuff damaged? Nope. 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 Okay. We're good. We are good. Okay, let's eat these things. So that should restore my health in just a minute. Okay, so through a little bit of help, I was able to find it. I wasn't too far off. It's just uh, about 100 meters or so off. Um, there's no water. No bladder fish. I'm going to go ahead and release these guys. No point in having them stuck here when I don't need them. Go ahead and save this. Get out my little scanner, dude. Ah, uh, warm me up, things. Hello. Hello. Oh, there we go. I definitely won't be needing all of them, but uh, just in case. Okay, light stick. Nothing was that way. Let's continue in the key with the little light. Okay, where am I going? Crap. I've been in here. <laughs> if there's a way to get lost, I'm going to find it. So, no, I haven't been there. My truck's on the opposite side. Okay, I'll go this way. So there's a light sticky that way. Hello, hello. That's not a scanny thing. Okay. Let's stick over here. I'm assuming I need to go this way. That's the cave I was just in. I'm running out of land here. Yeah, I did something wrong. Back where I started. Let's get warmed back up. It's gotta be up here. That's uh, that's where the coordinates are, and there's light sticks. Okay, so let's try this again. Okay, let's try going up. There's a light stick out here. Oh, there's a path leading up. Okay, here we go. It'd probably be easier if it was uh, light time, or uh, a daytime. <laughs> light time. Yeah, it's getting late. Okay, so... Ah, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Just looking for stuff around the base before I go running in. See if there's anything to scan. See if there's any PDAs. Any materials. Nada. Okay. Let's go in with my scanner. Satellite hasn't passed by in a while. I guess that was your doing. Maybe. Sam's not the only one in the family who knows, knew, what to do with vague directions and old wire. She was an original, that sister of yours. First time I met her, I was sure she was Altera through and through. Not a crease in her uniform. Sending those damn bird bots to spy everywhere. Then, she surprised me. Made 
maybe a little too much. Meaning? If you really want to know, there's a PDA on the bench that can point you in the right direction. You need anything else? Don't bother me. <laughs> but you can help yourself with greenhouse. The least I can do to repay you for getting those fine pests off my back. Okay, then. You had fruit. Why'd you give it up? <laughs> I can scan Margaret. Look all you want. There's more to Marguerite than any damn fangled gadget can see. <gasps> Plant shelf. Okay. Should I shut the door? I mean, it kind of makes sense. You know, I walk in and I'm like, hey. What was this? Oh, indoor grow bed. Okay, that's what I was looking for. Yeah. Okay, so I already got the Chinese potato plant. Composite plant plot. Okay, so those should be the three things. There's a, there's three different ones of them. That should do it. Okay, so let's grab... Um, scan that... I'll just take one of them. Yeah, both of these were in the original game as well, so that's kind of cool. And let's see, anything in there? Nope. Nope, I already got one of those. I already got one of those. I got that. Just a couple of friends talking. I've already talking. synthesized an antidote and stashed it in a cave. I can go grab it and... That's your plan? You don't think it'll work? You're thinking too small. Like maybe if you're polite enough about destroying the bacteria, Altera will come around and see it your way. But do you believe in yourself or not? I think so. You think so? Come on. Is a bacteria a threat or isn't it? It is. Does it need to be dealt with or not? It does. So who's right on this? I am. Say it like you mean it. I am. I, I am. Said, like you mean it, not like you're testifying before a rigged transgov court. I am. Great. Then what you got to do is seal off the whole cave. I've got just the stuff. Made it proficient, but it blew the whole ice shelf halfway to deep space. Whoops. Vaporized all the fish. Bummer. Okay. And you got to hit the lab too, or there's just no point. Actually, you know what? Let me take care of that one. It'll be fun. Oh. That sounds like sabotage. While I'm at it, let's uh, look at the rest of this. Okay, nothing too big there. High water content. Okay, that's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Habitat installations, interior grow bed. Yes, please. Okay, what's the other ones up here? Logs and communication. Margaret. I think that's how you pronounce her name. Hmm, okay. So I got those voice logs. I took a foo too. A uh, little whale. It's a wall planter. Let's mark that one. Plant shelf, interior grow bed. Yeah, there was, uh, maybe there was four of them. I don't know. I don't really need all three of them, though. Um, teleportation thing. I don't know what that is. Tether tool. Cool, more things to build. Old small marble melon. Ah, things to get. Rather All be right, Marge, old girl. We hate this greenhouse. So here are some pointers to remember so we never have to do the worst parts again. Too bad you can't fight malnutrition by hunting it down and killing it. So, first thing, insulation. Insulation. First few nights the soil was rock solid. Ended up having to insulate the damn place with dehydrated kelp. Adding a thermal That's not a bad idea. Too. Heat from barrels of water. 
Probably should have just eaten the damned kelp. But nope, my body was craving a salad. <laughs> Wish I was just made of exosuit. Next, grow lights were a must have. Gotta admit, I felt pretty proud of my first full crop of lettuce. Fed half of it to Preston. Ah, that's the animal. Stalker will eat practically anything. Always spits half of it out, though. Another thing we have in common. The slobbery green mess makes good compost. <laughs> that's funny. Hi there, Preston. Can I jump up and down on you? So I got the speaker. I think I've got everything here. Wait a minute, I just saw something. Preston's plant. Can I take some fruit off from it? What is this thing? Delightful to some. Okay, well I'll take that back and grow that. I'll grow that. So I guess that's everything. Are we done talking? Hello? Are we done talking? Are you going to say anything else? What is in there? It just looks like parts and things. Okay. So just real quick look around. The sun's back up, so it should be easier navigating my way out of here. I don't know why she has a greenhouse way out here so far away from her sea base. I guess we're done talking. Let's see if there's anything else out here. Yeah, hello. Okay, I've already been all the way around. Um, that's the way down. Why would she have a greenhouse all the way up here? That doesn't make any sense. Ooh, thanks. Sounds like uh, bad weather is moving in. And I'm definitely getting cold. Ooh, more things. Is there anything over here? Yep. Oh, inventory's full. I don't really need silver. How do I get down without busting my face up? Yeah, crap! Backpedaling for the win. <laughs> okay, so I guess that's it. She's not going to tell me anything else. Maybe once I return to my base, she'll say more? I don't know. I might be all done with her, though. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, so let's get rid of um, the beacon. I don't need that anymore. So I've only got the sea truck, the cameras, home, second home, beacon. Okay, so that's good. That's good. What's the other thing? Research? Preston's plant. Oh, okay. Interesting. So, we can't metabolize a part of it. But to some animals, when they metabolize it, it's kind of like a numbing thing for them. It, it kind of relaxes them. There are things like that. Uh, for example, chocolate. Um, when we eat it, there's a part of the chocolate that when we eat, it doesn't make like a poison. It, it, doesn't, we, it doesn't digest. But if you give it to like a dog, for example, they digest. They either digest the item that we're not able to, or they're not able to digest the thing that we're able to. I don't know, something along those lines. But either way, it's uh, chocolate is very harmful for dogs, whereas for humans, you know, it, it's okay to eat it. I mean, there's other examples, but that's probably the most 
wide known example out there. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and cruise home and I'll let you know if anything comes up. Hey, check this out. Spicy fruit salad. That that just came up. So I take Preston's plant leaf, mix it with uh, fevered pepper, and I, <laughs> I get fruit salad. Okay, so what I did really quick was uh, I took down the other two vases that were just like these two and put down the planter. I have Preston's fruit plant growing. I have one of these growing, one of those, and the marble. Um, I'm going to grab a Chinese hot potato and throw it in here as well. So far, this has been only the only um, indoor plants that i found that I can uh, plant. Which has been kind of disappointing, but uh, you know it. It is what it is, I guess. Ah, uh, but I arrived back in base, and I'm I'm actually not sure what to do right now. So I'm going to make uh, um, some of the uh, items that I got. Grab some titanium, and then go to my bedroom and put some of these items up. So, what do we got? Um, plant wall. Okay, that's cool. Um, I could put one in the corner. Eh. Okay, so what's the other one? I suppose I could bring a plant in here, but... Um, oh, here we go. Wall planter. Can I put that here? Nay. Um, put it here. Put it here. Oh, here we go. I can't really see it there, though. But I'm not finding a lot of options. Maybe I can put it um, somewhere here. Nay. Maybe, no. Speaker's there. Okay, well, I guess I'll put it back in the spot, the only spot where I could put it. Ah, here we go. What? I can't build it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I could probably put up some more of these. Here. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. These are probably full. Yep. So I'm going to empty these. Check on the old nuclear reactor again. Yeah, it's plenty full. Okay, so those two are going. I don't really need my scanner anymore, per se. And that's running. Let me put away my salts really quick. I have to build some more uh, storage units soon. Okay, so I want to make the fruit salad. And the first three I can uncheck because I've already done all those. Eh, they're probably closer down here under um, some of these things. Yep, let's get rid of that one and that one. Wall planter, lights are flickering again. Okay, so I'm going to make the trans or teleportation thing. that and that and some titanium lights are flickering like crazy I wish there was a fix for that so I need one plasteel, two aerial gel and an advanced wiring kit what did I find? oh yeah the fruit salad <laughs> that's so cool I got an extra tool, oh the tether tool Okay. okay so that's pretty easy to do so, oh, yep, yep. So I'm going to do an ingot. Then I'm going to change that into a plasteel. Which is that. Then I need an advanced wiring kit and two aerial gel. And I made a lot of those last time. I just have to find out where they are. Um, aerial gel. Here we go. And for the advanced wiring kit... Computer chip 
and oh, that's my clothing. Copper, silver, and let's put some of this stuff away. Actually, I don't think we need those anymore. Okay, so that should be enough to make an advanced wiring kit. Okay, what do I have right now? Wiring kit. And then when that's done, advanced wiring kit. Then I'm going to get silicone, like that, and then a green ion cube. And that is this will make the tethering tool. Oh, here we go. Tether tool facilitates instant travel to a bed C drop teleportation module. Ion cube required for use. I have ion cube. Or do you need one for every single use? Is that what it means? 35, so yeah, close enough. It'll max it out, but whatever. Well, hello, hello. Vehicle creation station. Let's get to work here. So, I had the storage, I had the sleeper, I need the docking module and the fabricator. Oh, I thought I had a fabricator. I have the aquarium, sleeping module, storage. No, I don't have the fabricator. Okay. All right, all right. Send my little droids to work. This is the teleportation thing. So if I understand this right, after I hook this up to my truck, it should power my teleportation module after I connect it. And then if I leave the tethering tool, let's see, at home, I sh oh, you know what? Um, I gotta move the sea truck. Let's put that there. Because I came down and there wasn't any room in the back end. Okay, so let's jump in here. I can't see anything, it's so dark. Let's come up here. That should be more than enough. So I wonder if we go back to uh, Margaret's seed lab, if she's still there. Because in theory, she's in her greenhouse right now. Hmm. I'll have to look into that. There we go. Okay, now we should be able to go in the back door here. Oh, hello, teleportation pod. Okay, that's exit. How do I turn it on? <laughs> hmm, I don't know how this works. Okay, so let's activate the little tethering tool. Okay, so this is arrival only. Oh my! I can't charge that back up. Man, that uses a lot of power. Sheesh. So maybe in the event of an emergency, I can get out really quick. But I don't have an infinite supply of ion cubes. And it looks like three uses a piece, and then I'm out of um, cubes. I don't know how to recharge that. Hmm. I don't know if this is a good thing or not. I mean, I made it. I tried it out. So for the time being, let's just kind of set that there. And I guess we don't, since we're not going to use it, I don't have to have it attached to my little truck here. Yes, I know, I know. Okay, so let's pilot this and put this like over here. Because I mean three uses and then you need a whole new ion cube. Oh, that's brutal. Okay, 
Okay, so we'll set that like that. So the truck's all set. Oh, um, probably power up the batteries. And for some reason, it's only using this one battery and not the other battery. So, whatever. So let's get back in here. Plug this dude in. There we go. And then I'm going to take the batteries out of some of the stuff that I've been using. So let's put this one here. Let's put that there. Uh, repair kit? Nope. So this one will be one. It seems to only really do this when I'm recharging batteries. I don't, I don't know why yet. And for some reason, the repair tool isn't um, sucking down power yet. Wait a minute. Click. There we go. So the logic holds. I'm going to recharge my batteries and let it so they're going to go bleep, 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 just like that, just like that. <laughs> okay, so let's get rid of these two plans because we already made them. That one, and then the tether tool. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't see doing that very much. <laughs> okay, so here's the plant, Preston's plant. But I need the leaves. I don't need the fruit. Um, is there another piece of fruit that I pick up on it? Um, where is my knife? Whoops. Okay, let's try a little bit closer. There. All right, so I got the leaf, and now I get one of these, and then, whoops, I just ate it. I just ate it. I did not mean to do that. Nope, I didn't do anything. How am I supposed to make it? Oh, uh, the fabricator, maybe? Oh, yeah, yep, 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 yep. All right, here we go. Salad does not traditionally involve leaves, but at least it is nutritious and warming. Thanks for letting me know. <laughs> I'll make fruit salad however I want, boy. Okay. All my batteries are all charged up. Okay, I'm missing something here. That one. So how much inventory space is that? That's only, holy cow. Food 85, H2O 30, body heat 100. Holy cow. Well, that pretty much solves my food problem. I'm gonna make a whole bunch of these and then um, put them in the, uh, the fridge. <laughs> Cause that's actually what you're supposed to do. So knife. Wow, that's quite a bit. Oh, crap. Ah, uh, I gotta go back and get another piece of fruit. Whoops. It's because apparently I can't plant the leaves. Ah, nuts. That's well. That's okay. So let's put some of these materials away. Um, I'm gonna put some of these other things in the fridge too once I get them. And then, and then, and then, I'm going to have us uh, some spicy fruit salad. Oh, I need some more fevered peppers. So, two of them. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So, I'll make three more of them.
That's kind of convenient how it puts it in like a little plastic tray as well. <laughs> So I wonder what I'd do with the nuts. Can I, like, add nuts to it? Because that'd be kind of cool. I'll bring uh, Margaret back some uh, salad. And she'll be like, ooh, that's nice. Wow, apparently I can uh, get quite a lot of plants. You know, I... I get a lot of leaves, and then, uh, yeah, I can get a lot of these fruit salads. Okay, so that's that. Got one left. I'm going to eat that. I'll put a bunch of these in the fridge, along with some water. Put my nutrient bar in there as well. Cool. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. So instead of having the nutrient bars... Wait, do these expire? It doesn't look like it. Because normal food, they have, like, it's up here, and then it goes down, and then it's bad for you. So I'm going to take these two out and put these in. Um, hey, little dude. I might have to make another fridge. <laughs> take some water out put these in so yeah sitting pretty this is this is good I like this okay so I'm going to travel back to Margaret's place get uh, some more um, some more of those uh, plant things but first I'm going to disconnect some of these things that I don't need the sleeping bed I, I really don't need that so my thinking is that the less things that I have, the faster the sea truck will go. I don't know if that's actually the case. Okay, so that's storage. This is gathering stuff. Oh, power cell. Yep. Um, there we go. So let's test that out real quick. Um, spinny do back around. Let's see, I want to go this direction. So let's look at our speed here. So before, it was just short of 9. Yeah, that seems to be the case. The less things I have... Oh, I just pushed space bar so it... Uh, yeah, it, it's not much faster, but it looks like about 0.4 meters per second faster. So, ish. <laughs> Alright, be back in a second. Okay, kind of interesting. I came back. She gone. She gone. She's not here anymore. She gone. So should I trash her place? <laughs> oh, that's horrible. I came back to uh, to get some more seeds. And uh, yeah, I'm not here anymore. Okay, so I'm going to grab a couple of these. Because I have a tendency of eating them. I mean, that should be enough. So my guess is she's probably back at her sea base. So if I were to go back to her sea base, um, she would probably be there. Maybe. I still feel like there's, there should be more here. Hmm. I think that's going to be my next project, though, to uh, go find her at her sea base and find out what's going on. But uh, I think that's going to do it for this video. Uh, I kind of ran over my marker a little bit, but uh, eh, that's all right. Figure out how to get back here without hurting myself too bad. It's a flesh wound. <laughs> okay, uh, I will see everyone in the next video. I... I will head back to this um, her little sea base and see what she has to say. See you then.